Good morning, stubborn nation. I got the beautiful, the lovely Miss Ashley with me today. Hello, everybody. And a lot of motorcycles behind us. Take a look. Holy cow. We are at the Full Throttle Saloon right here in Sturgis, South Dakota. And we're going to take you on, what's it called? It's called, uh, it's called the Fairview State Park. And it's supposed to be a beautiful ride. It's very close to Sturgis. So you'll find a lot of the riding around Sturgis is, you know, 45 minutes, an hour and a half away from Sturgis. This is one that's real close to Sturgis that you can take. And this is a great stop to do along the way. After the video, if y'all want to see inside the Full Throttle Saloon, we'll do a little short clip there. But let's get into the ride. Ashley, I think you said it best when you said sometimes it's just as important to show the roads not to go on as it is the roads to go on. For sure. How did that make a top 10 list? I don't know. <laughs> it should not have. It was on the Sturgis top 10 list when we looked it up. This is what's tough sometimes with the motorcycle community. Sometimes it's hard to tell the real rides that real riders are going to enjoy versus the things that, you know, the community might be pushing. Yes. This is why we've started a new campaign called Motorcycle Destinations Arkansas, where we're doing our first state. It's Arkansas Motorcycle Destinations. You go to sandoval.com if you've ever ridden Arkansas, and you can vote and nominate for the best rides, restaurants, nightlife, even off-road rides. All backers and their personal opinions. That's right. So. so when you come to a state, you can find the places you need to go. Anyhow, give them the quick tour of, uh, of Full Throttle, like we promised them. Yep and uh, we'll catch you back in a second. Look at this back, y'all. Find the weirdest things in Sturgis. Babe, we're trying to find some antlers for an antler chandelier for our house. Oh, wait a minute, there's a set right there. It's an old... He might know somebody. He might know somebody. Entering the lion's den. Full Throttle definitely wins a uh, number one burnout pit that I've ever seen. Oh, for sure. I've seen some good ones. There's a good one in Myrtle Beach at Suck Bang Blow, but this hey, one... we got another one here. That, that's a badass burnout pit. Years. That is my favorite thing about Full Throttle. All of, the, well, all of the machines that they've made into uh, yeah. usable space. Yeah, absolutely. It's everywhere. Even the inside's just full of machinery. All right. Well, the ride itself wasn't that great. Full Throttle was awesome. Oh. Awesome. Always awesome. I've never personally stayed there, so I can't give you a full recommendation, but I have friends who do that seem to like it. And this lake is looking epic, so we are going to jump in and we're going to catch you guys in tomorrow's video. Got to cool off. Got to cool off. Anytime you find a lake, you got to cool off. We always hunt water. We do. And no matter where we're riding, it's always like, where can we find water to jump in? It's perfect. But we got one here today. We'll see y'all in tomorrow's video. Bye.